The Juniper Tree is an amazing contemporary piece written by two composers actually, Robert Moran and Philip Glass. They composed a scene each and it's based on the Grimm's fairy tale story. It's revenge and lust and hunger and all these amazing themes threaded through this sort of amazing uh, contemporary opera. So it's about 75 minutes long uh, in one act and you start at the very beginning and you get chucked out at the end after this extraordinary musical experience. So the cast of the Juniper Tree is, is exciting and very unique. It's part of our, our artist development program at Northern Ireland Opera. We've taken upon ourselves to not only just train singers, but give opportunity to people like uh, young musical directors coming through, young stage managers coming through. And this is an opportunity for them to get paid experience in a, in a show that is, has a public outcome. And it gives them a real opportunity to experience life in a rehearsal room, to take charge, take responsibility, and to actually put off uh, a, a public outcome in a public show. This is really exciting to make my debut as music director. Now where I make the musical decisions, um, I've been able to work with the singers um, along the five week process and we've really enjoyed like finding the right kind of um, narrative to project when exploring the musical aspects of Philip Glass and Robert Moran's writing. The chorus development program is fantastic. Um, I've been a part of it since the, its inception really in 2021, 2022. Myself and my friends that have been in the chorus for the last few years, we now have had the opportunity to be main roles and that's extremely exciting. Our studio series is a brand new strand of programme for us here at the theatre where we'll be working with local production companies, writers and performers and bringing new pieces of work here to the, the studio space as well. It's so important that we widen the access to uh, the pipeline for career and talent development and support mechanisms that enable young people to reach the fullness of their potential. And in this way, not only is Northern Ireland Opera developing the sector, but it is safeguarding the future of operatic and creative talent in Northern Ireland. <laughs>